two fires at the same Raleigh apartment complex, only 12 hours apart. Right now, you can see firefighters on scene Monday afternoon. The video on the left, though, shows flames shooting through the building. It was recorded this morning by somebody who lives at the apartment complex. Both fires happened on Donald Ross Drive near the Raleigh Country Club. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. I'm Liz Ortiz. And I'm Bill Young. CBS 17's Joseph Holloway is live after talking to people who live there and digging for more information on if these fires could be connected. Joseph. Yeah, Bill Liz, right now firefighters are wrapping up the scene and they tell us that the fire started in the same area as the one that happened yesterday, but this time it spread to the apartments across the sidewalk. You can see some of the damage left behind at this building right now. The department is now investigating if this was a case of a fire flaring back up hours later or a totally separate fire. I heard something got up, fire was going. Clayton O'Connor sending us video of flames ripping through this building for a second time in just 12 hours. Firefighters say several apartments suffered heavy damage in Tuesday morning's fire, and O'Connor says he was told his home is destroyed. If everything's gone, it's, it's, it's a lot to take home, you know what I mean? This video showing fire and water damage in O'Connor's kitchen. R.J. Sydney is one of more than two dozen people looking for somewhere to stay after firefighters cut off the electricity to the buildings. One of my roommates, she was screaming and hollering those firefighters fire started up again. This ain't something that's supposed to happen back to back. A battalion chief says the cause of yesterday's fire was ruled undetermined. Okani and others who live here wonder if it's safe to even come back. We really shouldn't have still been here. You know what I mean? For two, somebody could have died. And the battalion chief tells us that thankfully no one was hurt. And also this time, no firefighters suffered any health-related emergencies. Live in Raleigh, Joseph Holloway, CBS 17 News.